And welcome back everyone. It's part two. So we're going to do this tutorial. We've got four weapons for you. We've got the localized inversion field, <laughs> the omnometron, the plasma burst, the arc welder, and the quantum payload. Of course, these are all names we've just made up for them because that's what you can do now. It's a completely modular system. We... So, I thought there was people in the chat. Oh, and everyone in Twitch TV, actually. Powered by the power <laughs> of Twitch. So I'm going to take my review chair, and uh, we're going to uh, show everyone how to do this. So, uh, highlights of this. It's doing. We're doing this live, but the highlights will be recorded for this video. So, I'm going to get started. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need to do... Whoa! I'm sitting on my home base right now. I'm joined by Yelby, Calberry, and Lichgrave. Um, thanks very much Hello. CW for the uh, epic sign which I've docked to my home base. This is um, a massive atoll. I'm going to quickly show you guys how to use jetpacks and then we're going to get into this weapons tutorial. So now you'll notice that space will attach you to an entity and that includes planets. So if I look into space I can jump around, I can do everything normal, but if I look at the floor and press space you'll notice that now my jetpacks are working. Look at my rocket boots. And if I press space, I will fall back down to the planet. So, you know. I love, I love how you metagame it. <laughs> so if I just want to activate I, I, I jetpack. I think we will add to this to make jetpacks actually activate. be something that requires energy and gravity. I think that right? would be epic. But in a ship, say if there is no gravity, yep. you won't necessarily fall down. No. Or let me rephrase that. On a planet, when there is gravity, Using your jetpack should charge energy, but um, if you don't use it, you fall down, right? But you're still able to move around in ships. It, it's supposed to connect you to a ship so that as it's flying through space, you stay with it. But yes, it has other fun effects that we will build on to make yeah. jet boots I'm or not... jetpacks <laughs> a, a more functional mechanic. For transparency, I'm not going to lie. I am kind of using the mechanic on the planet because you can right now. I don't know if that's going to stay, but it's epic. So um, <laughs> it is. You can actually use just, it for attaching just throwing to that a out ship. There, that yeah, you're metagaming jetpacks. I am. Yeah, I am. <laughs> so basically, uh, really, what this is for is if I was to attach myself to this vessel and someone else was too. So I've pressed space on it now. And now I'm actually, I'm just free floating. But if, are you able to commandeer this vessel? What, this one? Yeah, just take it and fly it a little bit. Oh no, I broke it. Oh well, it works in space. It's because he went so fast, the gravity got me. The planet ate my gravity. Oh, okay. But that's okay. Let's get back on with the tutorial. First thing I'm going to do, is give myself some IDs. So give ID, Tom, and I think it's three, four, Tom. seven. The reason it did that is because you were attached to the planet. Oh, whoops, my bad. Hey, I'm in the ground. Wow, you kind of glitched out there, bro. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a shop down. So I've got Calvary. one black hole and I've got a shop block. So I'm gonna whack that Calvary. down here. To... <laughs> Get on bugs.star-made.org, Mr. Lichgrave. I'm sure they'll need your log files, because... You have to get me out of the ground first. That looks pretty special. No, you can just sit there for a while. Okay. Aww. So the way I like to do it is, uh, if I don't know the ID, I'll just literally hit up the shop. I'll hit the block I need. So for example, if I need some of these damage pulse modules, there's not many here, I want a thousand of them. And I'm admin, so if I hit buy, buy recipe, and then go OK. 417 is the item ID listed in the error saying I can't buy it. So if I now type in give ID, my name, and you can do this pretty simply. I mean, I just use up and change the number, but if you go slash give ID TO tab, whatever the first two letters of your name are, space 416, and then, and then I've got my box. So that gives me what I want. Okay, so I'm going to push X, and I've got myself a ship core. We get in the core, press space for build mode, and and then we're going to put some symmetry on the middle. Y Z. I thought your moose eye could use a desk, so. Oh hell yeah! I might even come over there and just you know see the sights. I think I will actually. Let's just move over. So, so I so I gave it one. 
Uh oh, my core's struggling, struggling in the gravity. Okay, so I'm going to push X, and I've got myself a ship core. We get in the core, press space for build mode, and and then we're going to put some symmetry on the middle. Y Z. I thought your moose eye could use a desk, so. Oh hell yeah! I might even come over there and just you know see the sights. I think I will actually. Let's just move over. So, so I so I gave it one. Uh-oh, my core's struggling, struggling in the gravity. So I've now officially made orbit. So I'm going to get some hull and just make a sort of... Oh no, he's bumped me back into... <laughs> you troll! <laughs> so anyway, as we make our descent, watch as it gracefully plummets. Okay, so uh, now I've found... Should, uh, who, who's, who's got that pole beam? Tell, tell you into orbit. <laughs> no, I'm fine. I just need to build this. <laughs> Right, so I'm just going to make some sort of bits on it. Make it nice and easy. Right, okay, there we go. That'll do. Whoops. Right, so that's the front. I'm going to put some weapons on it. So this one is going to be a damage pulse. So I'm guessing I want the pulse near the front. So if I put the damage pulse computer, take the symmetry off. If I put the damage pulse computer like there, and then get the beam. Oh yeah, of course, the planet's blocking that. So we'll put it on top, it's fine. Okay, so get the symmetry back on. <laughs> I'll just make something. Fill the shape out. Oh, I bet it won't let me. Will it, will it, will it let me? Will it blend? I don't know, will it? It does when you're bounce, yeah, bounce it a little bit. I need you to rock it a bit so that it doesn't clip the planet. Nice one. Cheers. There we go. Good job, good job. Right, so what is this and how much does it cost me? It's a damage pulse system. And as it's going to be my master, I'm going to take a quick look. So it's got one group. Uh, blah, 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 blah. It's producing, it's drawing power. Oh, the power. So, let's take a look into the uh, Damage Pulse System Collective. So, it's going to give me 250. Reload is 10. 250 power, 5 damage, 10 range. I've got no idea what that equates to, so we're just going to try it out. Do -do 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 -do. So, I think we'll get... Oh, yeah, of course. Got a stick of power there. Another stick of power there. Yeah, it used half of the power tanks for that. And now it's regenning. Regenning. So I'm just going to make a basic L that doesn't touch. Take that up. Hit me. this out a bit. So I've got 6,000 per second. So basically if the main weapon is going to use... Could you fire that again? It didn't actually do anything that time. Didn't, didn't use any power. Can you try to trigger it again? Got a cooldown man. Hang on. Oh yeah. Sorry man. Uh, oh. Okay. Power depleted it says but it's not showing that it is. Oh, it's because I'm outside of the ship. My power is depleted. Oh, right. Because I'm an astronaut. <laughs> is it not depleting your power, though? No. It doesn't seem to be showing it. Maybe it's because I've got to hit... try shooting it. Maybe it's because I've got to hit something. You try shooting it. Alright. Whoa! I can't, I can't it's get... like a fucking Bronco. <laughs> I can't get there. Okay. So, so far, <laughs> we've managed to... We're testing it, yeah. <laughs> okay. So now we're going to put the uh, beam system in. 
So we're going to put the beam system down on the beam computer goes here. Well, you can put it anywhere you want, but I'm going to put it there. Um, and then you start laying down beam blocks. Okay. So then, what I've done is I've put a bunch of beam systems around the original pulse. So there's your beam system going around there. And there's plenty of room for the uh, explosive as well. So what I'm going to have to do now is link the two. So if I just take the master, which was this one here, and link it up to the beam, which is that one there. And as you can see in the menu, they're both linked now. We've got 139 damage pulse blocks and 104 beam blocks, giving us a 74.8% effect. And then uh, now all that's left is to put the effect blocks on. Right then guys, so I'm going to start by putting the effect computer on, so I'm going to take symmetry off real quick just to place it. I think I'll just put it, oh I didn't need to in the end, put it in the middle. <laughs> put the symmetry back on and explosives, so there's loads of room at the back. I like this wedge shape, let's see if we can keep it. Well, I like how he's rocking it around a little bit, it means I can get at the gaps. Cheers bud. I'm not actually. Oh are you not, is that just physics? Yes. Awesome. I love physics. Okay, so we're going to continue doing this. Let's see how many we've got. We've got 61, so I need to double it. Right. So we've finished off by... Oh boy, I'm going to collide with myself. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh dear. This how do you good. collide with yourself? Oh. Hang on. So... <laughs> What we've got here is a ship which uses damage pulse, beam and explosive. Of course you can just hit T mid combat and switch them, switch these around. So I could do it like this instead. Now I've got a damage beam. Oh, and of course you can set your output by just the planet's getting in the way. <laughs> Move from the planet. Whoops, but it's a beam with a damage pulse, so that's got a long tick. So if you watch, got to hold it. And it will say, you cannot attack a faction's home base. Are you going to take its shields down, are you? <laughs> I was trying to steal it. Oh, uh, right. So, have you, could you, has Cambot got shields? Ah, my chair Cambot doesn't. My wait, box. my chair doesn't have shields. Hey, Cal. Oh. Five. Strange. Oh, we'll be back. Well, that's how you would make it, but at the moment, I'm just gonna get out and look what it does. Yes, I had a hidden agenda. Shrooms for everyone. Oh, 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 no, get, get away, get away, get away, get away, <laughs> who just died? <laughs> there were fatalities, oh, oh, it's spinning, it's spinning. Tom, do you want to target? One does not simply kill Benny. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what the heck's going on here? The symmetry point's wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Only five, that's not that bad. It's Pretty much a daily occurrence, let's be fair. Okay, so this is where we're at currently. Um, put some wedges on, just like a really, really basic wedging. And because uh, it's got power tank powered weaponry, we put power tanks in there. It's an explosive damage pulse with a beam slave uh, and a power tank for the light. So we're going to give that one a go. Ooh. Green. Green bubbles. So I guess the next thing is to find something to shoot at. Wait, what happened? Did you Green get... Green damage balls. Yeah, but I know. It looks cool, doesn't it? Do you want something to shoot at? Yes. Have you got... Uh... Oh, Sorry. no! What's that? Turn... Disengage Bloom. There we go, bloom off. What is this? It's really a bakelite. Does it do anything? 
It didn't do anything. Oh. Five damage. Yay! So I'm gonna... no shields on it. Yeah, so I'm going to save this because it'll still work. Um, I don't really understand why. It should do damage to things that aren't shielded, so I think that's a bug. So I'm going to report that and move on to the next combo. So there it is. Really basic wait little ship. Me, really basic little ship. But intended as use for a fighter that you could dock in a carrier and AI. Use with AI. Yeah. <laughs> when they're able to actually use the damage pulse. Right, so moving on. <laughs>